you know, so, you know, it's kind of one of those things that's not going to really change it. Um, and I think but it'll, also, but it'll set the precedent or set a tone for, you know, what possibly could happen in the next year. It's going to set a tone for that year, like you were saying, set, set a tone for that year's rise. This is the first year we've actually kind of put a somewhat of a theme on, if you will, that I know of. Uh, so, uh, you know, to introduce that and to make that happen, I think we've got to try something. And we are, you know, 75% of our riders come from Oklahoma, but they're very capable people. And so they're, you know, unless you're OU football or the, you know, Thunder, that's the draw the crowds. There's everybody else kind of, so we got to have something. So it's going to have issues with that. Anyone else want to chime in? Ladies first? No. I mean, you know, I mean, Jim, you've been to the kickoff party. You know the excitement that, that's generated. And I think you, I think at this day and age, you have to do something. Like that. I think that you know, you look at the the audience here. The, there's a bunch of tourism people, but there's also a bunch of vet people. So everybody's competing again for the same pie, not to be said over and over again. But you know, there are are hundreds and hundreds of rides that are popping up every year in your area. And how are you going to expose yourself to that audience? How are you going to make yourself look like something different? You know, we've noticed that with their, um, through the, the board talking about the differences and what's changing in the cycling industry and stuff. And, you know, a lot of big rides, um, well-organized.